ambition. So yes, I can use, uh, and I must, yeah, if I make it singular, um, you can use plural in the case of exhibitions or in the case of an exhibition. I just wanted to show you how the articles work when you put them in, yeah? And as you can see, this is really important for articles. It's another thing that you need to know about. So, but in the case of an exhibition, they may last a few days. And so lastly, in the case of a breakdown, in the event of a breakdown, you can say that as well. In the event of a breakdown, please call this number. In the event of a fire, yeah, in the case of a fire. And so you can see, I'm trying to show you that even though you see these guys, really, this is a shortened version number two of number four. And all three of these, in case of, in the event that, in the case of, they do kind of all mean if or when, yeah? In case of fire, when there is a fire, yeah? In the event that, when you see a fire, yeah? In the case of, it's the same again, everything depends on the type of operation. Um, so uh, if it is a hip replacement, it's a bit more like that here. If it is a hip replacement, patients might wait as long as one year. Yeah, but you can see that two, three, and four are very different from the precautionary number one. That is different, yeah? And we do not mean, <laughs> this number one is not the meaning of number two or number three. It's certainly not what we mean when we say, in case of fire, break this glass. No, it's not, you know, to avoid a fire, break this glass. It's really not that, certainly not. Okay, I hope that's all clear. Please, as always, ask questions. Questions really help me make new classes. They help me understand what's confusing. And I will see everybody in the next class.